Hi there and welcome to a continuation from our last video on stem cells and differentiation. In this video, we're going to be looking at some exam questions associated with these topics. So let's get started. I'll tell you now, most of the questions you get with stem cells will be a list question. Um, and it's just using information given to list advantages and disadvantages of stem cell research. So over here, I've actually answered the question. So we've we're given some facts over here and we have to give two advantages of each and two disadvantages of each. So I've labeled the advantages in red and the disadvantages in black. Um, so we only need two of each. So two advantages would be stem cells from an embryo can grow into any type of tissue and large numbers of stem cells can be grown in the laboratory that would give you your two marks. And the two disadvantages could be stem cells may grow out of control to form cancers and patients treated with stem cells need to take drugs for the rest of their life to prevent rejection. Yeah, and that will give you your two marks. Next question. Some people might object to using cells from embryos in this way. Um, give one reason why. So we looked at this in our previous video. Some reasons might be ethical, uh, ethical um, or religious, uh, religious objections. And you only need one reason. So that will give you your one mark. Next question. Again, it's a list question, so I've actually answered it over here. Um, and we're just giving three advantages of stem cells from human embryos and three advantages of stem cells from an adult um, bone marrow. So three advantages are of stem cells from human embryos are the stem cells can develop into most other types of cells. Uh, each stem cell divides every 30 minutes and there's a low chance of patients' immune system rejecting uh, by the cells and three advantages of the adult bone marrow is it costs a thousand pounds to collect many cells and adults give permission for their own bone marrow to be collected and they use uh, the use of these stem cells is considered to be a safe procedure and that will give you your six marks in total next question human stem cells can develop into many different types of a human cell use the correct answer from the box to complete the sentence human stem cells may come from so that we've seen this in many cases embryos embryos will give you your one mark next question um, use the correct answer from the box to complete the sentence human stem cells can uh, be used to treat and this is one of the advantages it can be used to treat paralysis and that would uh, give you one mark uh, our final question stem cells can be taken from human embryos uh, in ther therapeutic cloning an embryo is produced that has the same genes as the patient name one source of the human stem cells other than human embryos so remember they can come from plants um, you um, call Mary stem Mary stem um, or you can say take stem you can say stem and that would give you your own mark and that is it for this video thanks for watching I hope you liked it and one last thing please subscribe and hit the like button